Hi everyone, in this video we will see how to send a XML message to a queue using load runner uh, protocol. So we have already recorded a video on this, but in that video we are sending a message in JSON format. So uh, now we have a request from the subscribers, so they want to know how to send the XML uh, message to a queue. Uh, to a, uh, using load random so they have some issues so in the, uh, because of that I'm recording this video hope this will help you so uh, in uh, I'm just on the screen you can see that the previous message and the uh, latest so the previous one which I commented is the first video first thing uh, which we have used to send the message to queue uh, which is in the JSON format and uh, now we are sending a message to a queue uh, with XML content. Okay, the only difference is like here the the uh, message is the content what we are sending is a uh, JSON and here what we are sending is a XML. So the content which is in double code completely is in a message format. So even the message is the key uh, which we sent to the queue. Okay, so this can be anything, the message or uh, it, it's a message forward basically, so it can be anything. So it is no, no need to make only as a message. So maybe here where you confused. Uh, so just to give a um, uh, clear expression, so now I, I made a complete data, complete XML content as a parameterized file. So if you open the parameter file, uh, I have added two lines of XML content. So let me open the notepad. So here, see if you see that we have multiple tags here. So uh, the parent tag is a note, and we have a child tag as two from and the body heading. Okay. So just in just to separate uh, the messages, I have made the modify the body content. So if you see the body content uh, here, to don't forget me on this weekend and don't forget me on this weekdays. Okay. So this is the XML content what we have used to send it to the server okay so let's go to the queue here so this is the queue what i'm using so if you see the text q1 so we don't have any data here so the message count is zero so now let's run it for one iteration uh, let's run it for one iteration uh, it's take a while to send a message yeah it's done yep. let's go to the message here yeah, okay Instead of refreshing, I'm switching the tab so that will load the data uh, very quick uh, instead of refresh. So if you see, we have one more message, one message here. Let's click on show here. So if you see that we have a uh, don't forget me on this weekend, the first row of the file. Uh, now I'm deleting this. So now when you run, when you run again, for the two, when you run it for twice, it you should see the two XML contents, uh, which is uh, one should be in the don't forget me on the weekend, and another should be don't forget me on the weekdays. Okay, so I'm closing the random settings. Let's run this. Done. Okay, now come to the file, go to attributes and the queue see the count as a two now click on the two i'm selecting the second one first this should be the my body message should be like don't forget me on the uh, weekdays okay yeah this should be a weekdays okay uh, the first one should be on weekends weekends and we got the xml content in the um, we send the xml content to the queue okay uh, hope this will help you friends thanks for listening this